because I'm shooting this shot with a little bit above top, a little bit above center, so it's got a little top. Because there's something about this that you need to understand. When you're shooting a ball off of that corner, this line on here, the opposite line from the one that you're aiming on, the opposite of your shot line, the opposite line is a tangent line. The tangent line is the line that if the cue ball, if you shoot a stop shot, the cue ball will stop right there. If you're at an angle and you shoot at the same stop shot, so the cue ball is sliding when it contacts that spot. Now the cue ball is going to go 90 degrees to the object ball. So we know if you come in on this angle and you hit that object ball, it's going to the pocket. The cue ball is going to travel 90 degrees and it's going to go snap scratch if you shoot that ball with a, with a stop shot. You can avoid the scratch by putting more bottom on it or by putting top on it. More bottom, like that just did, pulls you off to the side. So again, find your shot line, come over to your aim line, step into the shot, shoot a stop shot, and that was real close to a scratch. But as you can see, it follows the tangent line. So it doesn't matter. If I'm out here on the table, you do the same thing. Find your shot line, pivot over, till you're over top of the cue ball. That's your aim line. You shoot that so that ball sliding when it hits, it's going to scratch. So now you're learning the tangent line. That's important because you know. If you hit a stop shot, you know you're going to scratch. Now, if you were in a game of nine ball, see, now you have an advantage. Because you know if I just shoot a stop shot, I'm going to make the nine win the game. On the other hand, if you're in a game of eight ball, you know if you slide in that ball, you're going to, you're going to scratch. You're going to make the eight, you're going to lose. So what you can do is you can either go forward, miss the ball, get you back out here to the other end of the table, depending on how hard you hit it. All right, I'm in a game of eight ball, and the seven ball is my only other ball. I don't want to make the eight ball yet. So I know if I put top, it's going to hit that rail, come back out here, I'm not going to have a shot. So I can shoot low, draw the cue ball to the side rail, this side of the eight ball. How's that for shape for the seven? I think I can win that game. 